welcome back to another video um it's currently what is the day today wednesday um and i thought i'd do a little daily vlog um i've got a new bag that i want to unbox with you um i'm going to get my extensions um just maintenance so that they've obviously just like dropped down a little bit so i'm just going to get them tightened back up but i absolutely am obsessed with them i wasn't planning on keeping them in after the wedding but i literally just cannot not have them basically so i've got that um this afternoon and then i've also got some new holiday pieces that i want to share with you so that's the plan for um today's video so yeah i wanted to do an unboxing i gave myself a little treat after the wedding um like i said in my last video i was feeling a bit down and yeah i just thought i would treat myself basically and i'm so obsessed with this bag it is from loewe and i was just really after like i felt like i was missing like a summer style bag but one that wasn't like a big kind of like beach pool type of bag if that makes sense like something that i could put over my shoulder that would fit quite a lot of things in but was kind of had that summer vibe rather than like a leather style bag so i picked this one up and thought i would do like a little unboxing with you um so it comes in this little dust bag and it's got the loewe label on there and then this is the one that i went for so it is the Loewe Ibiza bag, I think the Raffia Ibiza bag, and I went for the all black. Um, I do really like the like tan wicker with like the brown or the cream. Um, but I do already have like my Chloe like beach bag, which is like which is brown. So I thought I would go for the black, and I do kind of struggle for a black bag of this size in my collection already. Um, and I'm just obsessed with this. I'm not sure if this is actually a limited edition color or not. But I just absolutely love it. It's the perfect size to pop over your shoulder. Let me take the stuffing out of the hand. And I can show you. So yeah, it's a really decent size. You can adjust these straps to make them longer if you want to. Or you can keep them. I've just kept them the standard way. Which literally fits on my shoulder like so i just absolutely love it um it's a structured bag but it doesn't it does have a little bit of like movement and it's got like the structured bottom so i'm really hoping this will like fully keep its shape um in terms of what you can literally fit so much in there um what i'm actually gonna do i think because i actually did wear it the other day and i didn't um put anything inside and you most of the things do kind of like sit down the bottom but i just kind of think for a little bit more security i'd rather have something inside so i think i might put like a little dust bag inside there and then have my stuff inside um just so it's kind of like not all open but yeah, i absolutely love it i've been wearing it like every single day with all of my outfits and yeah it's just a perfect kind of like shoulder bag which has got like a touch of summer to it and it's obviously not as big as like a beach bag like you wouldn't really be able to you can fit a lot on here but i don't think i would wear this as a beach bag itself it's just kind of like a summer everyday bag and i absolutely love it so yeah that is the bag i am so in love with it i'm so happy i got it i think it's around 400 and 60 pounds i believe so it's kind of similar prices to a lot of the other designer kind of like beach raffia bags out there um but i just absolutely love it i love loewe at the minute i think all of their stuff is incredible i would love to get it in a lighter color as well so i have both for a neutral outfit and like a darker outfit but yeah you don't need to save for a house so i'm gonna have to rein it in but yeah i'm glad i got this it is I'm real and I've reached for it every single day like when I've put on an outfit so I know that that's when I know it's a really good purchase and I'm gonna get so much wear out of it um so yeah sorry if you can hear the washing machine in the background I'm gonna let that finish because I've just literally put it on a spin and then I will go through some of the holiday pits a bit I have picked up so we're going to Ibiza in August which I'm super excited about it can't come soon enough like fact that it's still a month away makes me sad because i want to go now and then we've also just booked to go to cyprus in october just as a little winter kind of break because i think i've mentioned before but jamie's parents have an apartment there so yeah it's just a really easy holiday for us to go to we just book flights go and just have a really chilled week and we love it there so yeah that is the plan i'm hoping maybe to go away next month for like a weekend somewhere but we shall see it's on the cards but yeah I just need to kind of work out logistics and 
see if we can get away again because I just want to travel loads this year. I really, really do. Um, it just makes me feel very happy. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to wait for this washing machine to finish and then I will show you um, all of the holiday bits that I've picked up so far. Okay, so first up is a few items from Mango. So I picked up this gorgeous um, midi dress. So I absolutely love the neck detailing on this dress and it's just in like a really loose knitted material. Um, my only reservation with this is the bottom. I feel like it just goes a bit too wide for me, like I would prefer it to be a bit more slimming and a, probably a little bit more longer. I feel like this is quite a weird length. That's where I'm just drinking them by the way, if you wonder what that noise was. Um, so yeah, I'm not too sure, but I just, I do really love the top detailing of this. I'm just not sure on the bottom. So yeah, let me know down in the comments below. And then I also have got this braided bag. I'm probably thinking, do I actually need this bag? But I absolutely love it. So it looks black on camera, but it's actually a really dark brown. Um, and again, it's just a really nice day bed. I think it goes really, really well with cream. And I obviously wear a lot of cream. So I think this will be really, really nice. It's really comfortable on the shoulder as well. Um, the pleat is really soft. Um, it's got a zip inside as well. Um, and it just fits quite a lot in. So yeah, I really, really like this. I think the bag was around 80 pounds. And I think the dress was 60. Okay, so next from Zara, I picked these um, printed trousers, which I absolutely love. It's so different for me, but I really love the colours of the brown with the blue. Um, so I actually did order these in an extra small, and I could not even do them up. Like, could, yeah, it was so tight around here. So I ended up ordering a medium. I went two sizes bigger. Now, they're perfect on my legs, but oh, I've just got a hairband there so I could just kind of show you before showing you that they were too big. Obviously, they're way too big. So I'm thinking of getting the waist taken in because they're huge, but the leg is perfect. So I think the small will still be too tight on the leg. So yeah, I don't know what's gone on with the fitting of these, whether they're they just don't, don't fit right at all. Um, so yeah, just bear that in mind. I absolutely love the print. I'm just going to get them taken in at the waist there. And then I've just paired them with a black bikini. This one is also Zara. I think this was Zara home last year, but I'll see if I can find any similar. But yeah, I just really thought that these were something a bit different. I've got quite a lot of like beige neutral trousers and I don't have anything printed. So yeah, I thought these would be great for Ibiza. You can obviously wear these as a smarter trouser as well. They're probably more for a smarter trouser rather than a beach trouser. But the reason why I sized up um, two sizes is that I want them to be quite baggy. I'm just going to get them taken in a little bit on the waist as well. But these with like a black like silk top would also look really, really nice for an everyday outfit. I'm actually thinking, do I just wear them lower and just have them more relaxed? I don't know. Don't know if I prefer just to have them. So that's what if I got them tailored, they would be like here. So does that look better? Or does it look better just to have them like really low low kind of like baggy trousers? Maybe they're not meant to be high waisted. Oh, I don't know. I really don't know now. Okay. Next up is this sarong from Anim Bing. Excuse, I've just got my underwear on then. I've not obviously got a bikini on. Um, but I just absolutely love this. Quite a lot of my sarongs are like in the shape of a sarong. Whereas this is a full blown square. So you can wear it as a sarong like this. You can kind of fold it, wear it a little bit shorter. I just loved the cream and the black print. Um, and then you can also use this as like a towel if you wanted to. Because like I said, it's a big square. It's a super, super soft material. Um, and yeah, I just really, really like it. I think it's just so nice to have in your beach bag if you just want to chuck on, if you're going for like lunch or whatever. Um, and yeah, it's really good to be able to use as like a little bit of a blanket slash towel, like beach towel as well. Okay, so next up, this bikini from Weekday. I am so obsessed with this crochet bikini. The fit of it is just honestly incredible. So I've got a medium in the top and then a small in the bottom, small in the bottoms. Um, and it just fits great. It's got, it's a soft crochet, but I feel like it's got quite a lot of structure to it as well. Um, I love the fit of the bottoms. They're like really, really high waisted. And yeah, I just absolutely love this. I don't think it was too expensive. I think it was maybe around £40 for the whole set. I'm not too sure, but I'll leave the link obviously below. Um, and yeah, I just thought like this would be really nice with some like floaty beach trousers, maybe like a green or an orange. Um, obviously, I've not worn it in like the sea or the pool yet, so I'm not so sure 
how it's going to hold up with water but we shall see but yeah apart from that i really really love this okay so this last dress i'm not actually sure if i've shown this to you already but i thought i would show it just in case um but it's this pull and bear like scrunch uh kind of like i'm gonna wear this as a beach cover-up but you can obviously wear it as like a going out dress you can wear it as a day dress it's really really versatile um i just absolutely love this material it's got kind of like a scallop edge on the end if you can see there um it's got these kind of like flare sleeves which i really really like and they're super long which i also love and then the back is a backless oh sorry that's the tag caught up there there we go it's just gorge i absolutely love it i do have obviously underwear on underneath this and you can't see it i've not got a bra on but you you probably would wear those like stick on ones because you can't really wear one because of the back either but i just love this it's so easy again just to chuck on really good like beach club type of outfit um i just really really love it really love this it was super hard to get hold of i am going to say that now so yeah if it's out of stock just keep checking keep refreshing um because yeah it came back in stock for me so it definitely come back in stock for you as well what a morning it's currently 20 past 12 i've just taken ralph out for a quick little walk um just because i'm heading out in an hour so i want to make sure he's done his business before i leave um i've just filmed another video done all the trying on clips and yeah i'm just about to have some lunch i've put some breaded chicken in the oven and i'm gonna have a sweet chili chicken wrap i absolutely love them it reminds me of the mcdonald's ones oh, it's so incredible um i just want to talk about my hair because i've been using the ghd wand um recently well when i wash my hair i use the air wrap um and have like a bouncy blow dry and then on like second day hair um i use the wand and especially when i'm filming i use the wand because the curls just last so well like i've honestly got changed about 15 times maybe more this afternoon no more than that because i did the holiday clips um the holiday bits for you earlier so yeah i've changed a lot and it just really really holds like a really nice curl so i find by doing both the air wrap and the tongs like i probably use the tongs like twice a week maybe that my hair's still in really really good condition just like i said yeah i think it holds a lot better um what was I trying to say sorry the curl with the tong holds a lot better than the air wrap when i'm like changing and trying on like so many different outfits um but yeah so i really like that i'll leave that down below because i actually looked today and i popped it on my instagram stories and it's currently on sale so that's always a bonus um but i still love my air wrap and i do use my air wrap a lot as well but yeah i'm just enjoying having two different kind of hairstyles because the air wrap's more of a bouncy blow dry whereas this is like more of a soft wave um i'm just watching a series called all american at the moment i do love like a an american teen drama and there's four seasons so it's nice to watch on my lunch break and in the background as well so yeah i'm just about to have my lunch and then i am gonna edit hopefully edit at least one video um before i go to my hair appointment this afternoon and it's getting really muggy i need to open this um oh, open this door um but yeah but it's turning out to be a nice sunny day which is a bonus i've also just put our froze in for wash which is why i need to hoover this actually which is why yeah this is a bit, i actually am obsessed with the color of this sofa it's incredible but we've been trying to save it until we move into the new house so it's like still like brand new and it is honestly in really good condition because we've had the froze the froze right up there but if you can see we've had the froze over the top of it since we got it so yeah that's the plan to try and keep it nice and fresh until we move and then we can have the color out because it's just honestly the most gorgeous color ever today's wrap so we've got chicken cucumber a bit of salad and sweet chili sauce Hi guys, it's it is the next day and I've just balanced you out. I had my extensions refitted yesterday, so I thought I would just show you um them actually because I have got a lot of questions on my Instagram. So it's basically I've got an LA weave and it's just literally weaved through your hair like that. And I literally have one across the top which goes like here and i also have another one around here and yeah they're honestly incredible i love them so so much definitely could not be without them now um you might oh god i just got my finger stuck oh just shut the door because jamie's on a call um i'm just making a 
cup of tea and then I'm going to edit this video and also a Zara haul which will be up on Sunday. Um, I actually got some new pillows from Dusk. They're like this linen style cover which I really really like. I cannot wait to change this bed when we move. I do not like it at all. Right, my camera battery is flashing. So I'm gonna end this video now. I really hope you guys enjoyed this kind of like vlog haul style video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below and I shall see you all in the next one.